8. This is a good chapter, by the way. It's a very important chapter. This chapter has a six uh, sections in it. Okay, we're going to be uh, taking those sections uh, one at a time. So we're going to do them in order. Now, the first section is going to be about symbol payment loans. Now, you, you took a loan from a, from somewhere, from a bank, from a, uh, any, any organization, and you're going to pay it back as, as a full payment. Okay, so it's not going to be as an installment. You're going to pay it, you took it, and you pay it at a certain time. So you have a maturity value, what we call, and that's we're going to be using something called ordinary interest and exact interest. Ordinary interest is usually 360. An exact interest is a 365. Usually banks use the ordinary interest, which is the 360. Okay, so when we do the calculation, remember in the other chapters we took uh, the calculation per day as a 365. All right. But now, if the question mentions the ordinary interest, you have to you have to divide by 360. If the question mentions exact interest, exact means you know the way we know it in actual life. If I ask anybody how many days in a, in a year, everybody will say 365. So that's we 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 inter, you know we connected the word exact with that all right ordinary usually banks to use that banks like to use them 30 days per month so that's why they have three, 360 days per year okay so that's the idea behind it so maturity value what does it mean it means you know if you took a loan and you're gonna pay interest on top of it so the interest plus the principal that you took from the bank that's your maturity value that's how much you need to pay the bank paid. Here's an example of it. Okay. Somebody's taken a loan for $7,200. They've taken it for 91 days. So you need to, to calculate the interest. And after you, uh, you do the interest, and now they're showing you that you have to do the interest in two, two different ways, ordinary and exact. Remember, the exact, go back to the exact, easier to memorize. Exact is a 365. Ordinary is the other one, is the banks, which is 360. Okay. And you will go from there. That's what we're going to be doing. Now, the next section <clears throat> would be a talk about installment loans and amount financed. So how much money that you going to be paying on a monthly payment? Okay, or it doesn't have to be monthly. It depends on, on, on how they're going to set it up. Here, for example, they have you an example of you. You're taking a loan for $1,300 and you make a, a down payment of uh, $199. So, no, this is not even that. So you're just buying this for this amount. And they're gonna pay down payment of 199. So how much money you, uh, you're gonna you're gonna be financing? So you need to subtract 199, so almost 200 dollars from uh, 1,400 dollars almost. So you, you're taking from a bank or whatever 1,200 as a financed uh, amount. So financed amount is that's like saying the amount that you took for a loan, right? And and we'll do the installment when we when we when we go there. So down payment and then the installment and that's how it works okay then we'll do the monthly loans and payments and finance charges later on okay guys talk to you later bye bye